Well, we continue our conversation about a string of cases that involve the Humble Park community. Esther Hernandez started the organization Innocent Demand Justice to address the investigations made by a former Chicago police detective in the 80s and 90s. She's joining us now to explain what they're doing through this group. Welcome. Nice to have you. Thank you. I want to first talk about uh, these reviews that state's attorney Kim Fox said that she would do of these pending cases. These cases where men are saying they were framed by Ronaldo Guevara. Two years ago, she made that promise that she would review them. Where are we today? Are we any closer, you think, to having a review of those cases? No, you know, it's been two years, um, and every time we reach out to her, we have, you know, we ask about it, and she says, uh, oh, that's our priority. We're working on it. But we don't see no results. It's like still in progress. Mm -hmm. They're doing this investigation. Uh, <clears throat> when I, when we reach out to the integrity unit who's doing the investigation, they tell us, oh, well, it takes time. We got to do these cases one by one. And it takes a lot of time. But my thing is, these guys have been in prison for decades. What more do you need to investigate? And right. how long is it going to take yeah, to do this? And these are obviously very complicated cases because they go back in yes. many instances, mm -hmm. cases. But for the families, for the mothers, for the men who are either behind bars or are waiting to clear their names, what has this time been like for you? Oh my God, it's been a nightmare. It's, you know, to think that your kids are innocent and they're in there for a crime that they didn't do. And it was not only one of my kids, it took both of my sons at the same time for the same crime. And so they've been there for 24 years. They both have. Both. Mm -hmm. For 24 years. And um, every year they're like, Mom, this is going to be the year we're coming home. You know, it's the hopes are like, you know, you want to hope and you want to. But then you started this organization, Innocent Demand Justice, and I imagine obviously you're working on these Guevara cases, but your work goes well beyond that. Um, yes. Explain to me what the organization yeah, so is. Yes, so you know to what? Do. We found we found Innocent Demand Justice to expose and, and shed light to the corruption and frameworks for former dis disgraced detective Renato Guevara, who terrorized Humboldt Park community. Guevara has been accused of framing more than 60 men and women, and so. Our job, you know, what we do is we get together as families, families and friends. We got together, you know, to um, put the pressure on, you know. To keep and, the pressure on Yeah, to keep the pressure on, mm -hmm. you know. And so when we began this uh, uh, Innocent Man Justice in 2013, you know, we are a group of family members and friends. Mm -hmm. Because of police frameworks, we support wrongful conviction cases throughout Illinois. Our work is primarily focused on the so Northwest. It's not just, yeah, so it's yeah. not just this case, but you're looking at other cases, other cases as a whole. And mainly Humble Park, yeah. you know. And I would imagine some of these families, really, you find a connection with these families yes. and some support with one another. Tell yes. me what that's like. Wow, that is something because when we we meet, you know, and they come to my meetings and they start crying, it reminds me of me. Yeah. Because when this hap first happened to me, I thought I was by myself. I had no one. Mm -hmm. So it was so hard. And then when I meet these other families, uh, you feel the support, you yeah. know. And we're together and we're gonna fight. And we're gonna fight until justice prevails because uh, back then, you know, we when I first started with this, it was called uh, Comité Sihimo Justicia, we demand justice. And that's when I was like, you know, in pain, you're like, I need to do something. Now you've, yeah, you yeah know? now you've turned it into this exactly. innocentdemandjustice.com for people who may want yes. more information. You can find it at that website. Uh, we hope you get the closure that you're looking for um, in the coming months, certainly yes. within the next year. Thank okay, you. Okay, we'll be in touch.